do it. So uh, here we are now at the Reporting Change event where the book uh, Stories of Change have been launched for the first time here in Holland. And with me I have uh, Jeroen, uh, the designer of the book from Kummer and Hermann, the design duo. Uh, and uh, for the connected learners, uh, as we like to call them, the people who are watching the Connecting Learning website, this, most of them, or uh, many of them, are at least young photographers who are just getting started. And many of them have a dream of publishing a book of their own work. Do you have any tips for them what they should consider or what they shouldn't do? Or mm. Well, I think I, I, I understand that uh, when you want to publish something, uh, there is all, always a kind of an urge to get things out. But I think you should be aware that um, there is only, um, uh, how do you say, there is one moment where you can publish it. So you have to be really careful how you publish it. It's your work. It's your story you want to, to bring across, and so so uh, I wouldn't hurry too much. You know, I, I I meet a lot of photographers who are quite unhappy with the way they publish their first book, and it can happen because they they were pushed by a publisher, or I mean, or they were themselves in a too much hurry, or uh, it's good to have a deadline. I mean, don't understand me wrong. Of course, you know, you need to to there needs to be a moment when it really c uh, gets out there, but. Uh, it's you should be really careful about the way your story is being p published and also be careful that not somebody else like a designer uh, <laughs> kind of gets away with it because it's uh, it's your story so be careful with it so I think that's maybe the most important thing I can yeah. say yeah. and do you also think that it's better if they come with already a suggestion of how they would like to structure their story or their book or with even like a first design or how or should they just find someone that they really trust who could do the design for them I think trust is really important and I, I don't believe there is really like a, a recipe you know like a fixed recipe how you should make a book um, I think it's good to already think about um, why do you want to publish a book why do you want to publish the work and who should be interested in it because there are already so many books eh? so it's I think it's maybe it sounds a bit like an obvious question but I still think it's a it's a very important one and think about that uh, before you kind of um, talk with it with other people also I think uh, when it comes for to, to design for instance I think it's always good to kind of speak uh, to kind of to kind of speak about it with with not just with one designer or with one party, but always kind of check check uh, have have some alternatives. It's also trust is really important. You know, it's it's. I think when the trust is there, um, it also opens up like the the dialogue and the kind of process which is needed. You know.